Hi, Andy here at Hawkins Bazaar, and today we're going to be taste testing the Everlasting Flame hot sauce from the good people at the Chili Alchemist. It's a red habanero sauce, but it also contains a chili extract that measures over 6.4 million Scoville heat units. That's more powerful than police pepper spray. So out the box you've got a sort of glass Alchemist style potion bottle, which is sealed with wax and a cork in the top. I think we should have a taste and get some other people from the office in to have a try as well. Red habanero chilies, barley malt, vinegar, carrot, onion, garlic, lime juice with sulfates, 6.4 million SHU chili extract. I'm not sure this is the best idea I've ever had. I've smelled that before. It's like when you smell meal vanish from over, it just... I think it's pain. <laughs> it does, it smells of torture. Everlasting flame. Because when it's not blowing from one end, it's blowing from the other. It smells like feety tomatoes. Shall I see if I can get some carrot? I'm, I'm sweating the new, even trying to think about doing it and the outcome. You spare me. Oh, a bit. <laughs> yeah, it's quite nice. They have some hot sauces and they don't taste very nice. That, that's got a reasonable flavour to it as well. No, it's not the hottest thing. <laughs> Give it some more. Beyond the realms of enjoyment. It's not a, oh, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a really strong chilli masala or something like that. But it's a weird one because I'm eating it off a plastic spoon with no, nothing else. So. If I had a second spoon for then I'd cry a bit more. Yeah, it is almost like a, a pureed soup. Um, I wouldn't recommend doing it like a soup. I'd probably have that with pasta actually. <laughs> this sort of thing I would dip my chips in. I'm going to be more brave. A bit limey as well. I can feel something a bit sweet underneath. I think I can taste my own tears. It's not a burn, it's more of a a warmth, a glow. If food doesn't hurt, I don't eat it. I told, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Apparently if you put too much heat in it, it goes very, very bitter, but this is really, really sweet. All good, yeah. I really enjoyed that, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. <laughs> it's just got more intense in my left ear. Kids, don't do this at home. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, that's hot. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that's not nice. <laughs> that's not nice at all. Why would you eat that? Oh, oh, oh. oh I'm getting hot. Your tongue back in your mouth. Everywhere. Oh, now it's up my nose. Oh. I don't think hot tea was a good idea. And it's getting hotter. I think that's probably the hottest thing I've ever had. That is warm. I feel like sucking in cold air is good. It's just like fire. Oh, an entire spoonful. <laughs> it's not <laughs> the recommended dose. It's getting worse. Ow, no, I can't drink that tea. It's hurting. You got any nachos? <laughs> <laughs> oh, You're crying. A little bit. Oh, it's rendering me speechless. That was such a bad idea. Oh, oh, oh. oh. How much longer do you want to sit here? So that was the everlasting flame hot sauce from the Chili Alchemist. As you can see, it's very warm. If you have any questions or want to ask us a question, just drop a comment in the box below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Anyway. <laughs> Thanks for watching! <laughs> That's hot. I'm off to blow my nose now. I mean, seriously, who's gonna, who's gonna eat that normally anyway? Do people? You could not use that within six weeks. <laughs> oh, I feel a bit dizzy. I think I'm done now. <laughs>